And the word of Yahweh came unto, unto me, saying, Son of man, set thy face against Gog, the land of Magog, the chief prince of Meshach and Tubal, and prophesy against him. And say, Thus saith the sovereign Yahweh, Behold, I am against thee, O Gog, the chief prince of Meshach and Tubal, and I will turn thee back, and put hooks into thy jaws. I will bring thee forth, and all thine army, horses and horsemen, all of them clothed with all sorts of armor, even a great company with bucklers and shields, all of them handling swords. Persia, Ethiopia, and Libya, with them, all of them, with shield and helmet, Gomer, and all his bands. Gomer, and all his bands. Gomer, and all his bands. Gomer and all his bands. The house of Togomar of the north quarters and all his bands and many people with thee. Be thou prepared and prepare for thyself. Thou and all thy company that are assembled under thee and be thou guard under them. After many days thou shalt be visited in the latter years. Thou shalt come into the land that is brought back from the sword and is gathered out of many people against the mounts of Israel, which have been always waste, but is brought forth out of the nations and they shall dwell safely, all of them. Thou shalt ascend and come like a storm. Thou shalt be like a cloud to cover the land, thou and all thy bands and many people with thee. Thus saith the sovereign Yahweh. It shall come to pass that at the same time shall things come into thy mind, and thou shalt think an evil thought. Thou shalt say, I will go up to the land of unwalled villages. I will go to them that are at rest, that dwell safely, all of them dwelling without walls, having neither bars nor gates, to take a spoil and to take a prey, to turn thine hand upon the desolate places that are now inhabited, and upon the people that are gathered out of the nations which have gotten cattle and goods that dwell in the midst of the land. Sheba and Dedan and the merchants of Tarshish with all the young lions thereof shall say unto thee, Art thou, art thou come to take a spoil? Hast thou gathered thy company to take a prey, to carry away silver and gold, to take away cattle and goods, to take a spoil? Therefore, son of man, prophesy and say unto God, Thus saith the sovereign Yahweh, in that day when my people of Israel dwelleth safely, shalt thou not know it? And thou shalt come from thy place out of the north parts, thou and many people with thee, all of them riding upon horses, a great company and a mighty army. And thou shalt come up against my people of Israel as a cloud to cover the land, and it shall be in the latter days. And I will bring thee against the land, against my land, that the heathen may know me, when I shall be sanctified in thee, O Gog, before their eyes. Thus saith the sovereign Yahweh, Art thou he of whom I have spoken in old time by my servants, the prophets of Israel, which prophesied in those days many years that I will bring thee against them? And it shall come to pass at the same time when Gog shall come against the land of Israel, saith Yahweh, that my fury shall come up in my face. For in my jealousy and in the fire of my wrath have I spoken. Surely in that day there shall be a great shaking in the land of Israel, so that the fishes of the sea and the fowls of the heaven and the beasts of the field and all creeping things that creep upon the earth and all the men that are upon the face of the earth shall shake at my presence and the mountains shall be thrown down and the steep places shall fall and every wall shall fall to the ground. And I will call for a sword against him throughout all my mountains, saith the sovereign Yahweh. Every man's sword shall be against his brother. And I will plead against him with pestilence and with blood 
and I will rain upon them and upon all his bands. And upon the many people that are with them and the overflowing rain and great hailstones, fire and brimstone. Thus will I magnify myself and sanctify myself and I will be known in the eyes of many nations and they shall know that I am Yahweh. Amen. That's right, Gog. Most High says you cause his fury to come up in his face, buddy. And it shall come to pass at the same time when Gog shall come against the land of Israel, saith the sovereign Yahweh, that my fury shall come up in my face, okay? And I will call for a sword against him throughout all my mountains, saith the sovereign Yahweh. Every man's sword shall be against his brother. That's right. All you heathens going to kill yourselves up, okay? All right, Mr. FBI, Cointel Pro, okay? Nah, it ain't us. It's not the Hebrews. That's the goddamn terrorists in this damn country. No, you motherfuckers, you, you the terrorists, okay? You were the terrorists when you came to this place. All right? Yeah, we are. Yeah, we are the biggest threat, I suppose. To the motherfucking country. I guess so. If knowing our identity as the children of Israel is a threat, then I suppose you could consider us the greatest threat indeed. Okay? But it's not the threat that you're trying to portray us to be. Okay? When you got Stephen Paddock, who got dozens and dozens of guns, okay? In a fucking secured hotel and could just shoot for 10 fucking minutes before somebody stop his ass, okay? No, that's the goddamn greatest threat to America, homegrown terrorism. No, not the Hebrews who you brought here, okay? No, it ain't us. We ain't the terrorists. Just because we saying we the Hebrews and y'all gonna go into slavery, the FBI wanna call us terrorists for that. What you think about that? Well, guess what? You with him. You signed up with him. You a part of Goma and all his bands and the Most High got five for your ass too, okay? That's right. And I will call for a sword against him throughout all my mountains, saith the sovereign Yahweh. Every man's sword shall be against his brother, okay, you damn heathens? So don't worry about the black man killing your sorry ass. Your own brother gonna kill you, okay? That's right. Your own goddamn kind, you goddamn heathens. Get ready for some more fire, okay? That's right. All right? All right, San Francisco, we've been very merciful to you, okay? Been very merciful to you, San Francisco. But we're going to drop our word against you, too. We're going to drop our word for the Most High got a sword, and it's going to be bathed in heaven, okay? And he's going he's gonna to slay many in his day. From one end of the earth, even unto the other end of the earth, you damn heathens. So ain't nobody going to miss this party, all right? Ain't nobody going to miss this party. Yeah, straight up. And I saw heaven open. And behold, a white horse. And he that sat upon him was called faithful and true. And in righteousness he doth judge and make war. His eyes were as a flame of fire, and on his head were many crowns. And he had a name written that no man knew but he himself. And he was clothed with a vesture dipped in blood. And his name is called the Word of Yahweh. And the armies which were in heaven followed him upon white horses, clothed in fine linen, white and clean. And out of his mouth goeth the sharp sword, that with it he should smite the nations. And he shall rule them with a rod of iron. He shall tread, and he treaded the winepress of the fierceness and wrath of El Shaddai, Almighty Yahweh. And he hath on his vesture and on his thigh name written, King of Kings and Masters, Master of Masters. Okay?
And I saw an angel standing in the sun and he cried with a loud voice, saying to all the fowls that fly in the midst of heaven, come and gather yourselves together unto the supper of the great Elohim, that you may eat the flesh of kings and the flesh of captains and the flesh of mighty men. That you may eat the flesh of kings and the flesh of captains and the flesh of mighty men and the flesh of horses and of them that sit on them and the flesh of all men, both free and bond, both small and great. And I saw the beasts and the kings of the earth and their armies gathered together to make war against him that sat on the horse and against his army. And the beast was taken. And with them the false prophet that wrought miracles before him, with which he deceived them that had received the mark of the beast, and then that worshipped his image. These both were cast alive into a lake of fire burning with brimstone, and the remnant was slain with the sword of him that sat upon the horse, which sword proceeded out of his mouth, and all the fowls were filled with their flesh. And I saw the dead, small and great stand before Yahweh and the books were open. And another book was open, which is the book of life. And the dead were judged out of those things which were written in the books according to their works. So if you break the law of Moses and become a man stiller, then what's the judgment for you? If a man that you stole get found in your hand, you will be put to death. What's going to happen when Jesus returns and find his people in the hands of Gog, in the hand of Magog, Meshach and Tubal, Ashkenaz, Togomar, Rifpla. Huh? What's gonna happen when he come and find us in your hand, Goma? You shall surely be put to death. That's what's gonna happen. You goddamn man stiller, okay? That's right. They were judged according to their works, all right? And death and hell were cast, and, cast, and death and hell were cast into the lake of fire. This is the second death. And whosoever were not found written in the book of life was cast into the lake of fire, okay? All right, and why is all of this? All of this is because Satan had his way with you. And the scriptures tell you that's what happened, okay? That's right. Verse seven of Revelation 20. And when the thousand years are expired, after Satan is loosed, Satan shall be loosed out of his prison. And what shall he do once he's get out of jail? What, what Satan did, what did Satan do once he got out of jail? He went out to deceive the nations, the heathen, which are in the four quarters of the earth, east, west, north, south. Okay, who's in the east, west, north, south? It's all you so-called Caucasian, so-called European, all you sons of Japheth. Just like the Most High said, Japheth, you made up the coast of the heathen. So Satan went out to deceive you, Japheth. Your son, Goma, and all his bands, Gog and Magog. He deceived you to do what? To, to gather you together to battle. And your number was as the sand of the sea. Okay, and what happened was uh, the, the devil deceived you and got you all full of pride and puffed up. And they went up on the breadth of the earth. Like I said, you went up all through Africa and could pass the camp of the saints about. We was camping out in Africa and the beloved city. You, you got Jerusalem first, okay? And fire came down from Yahweh out of heaven and devoured them. Okay? Yeah, that's right. That's the result of that. And fire came down from Yahweh out of heaven and devoured you, Gog, Goma. Okay, America, it's you, okay? You're the seed of Gog, okay? You're the seed of Goma, America. So wake the hell up and smell the goddamn coffee, okay? It's judgment day, you son of a bitches. That's right. And we were commanded to give you a double portion. All right? Okay? So Trump, you want us to worship your flag? We told you, you worship your own motherfucking flag. You salute your own flag, all right? Now you get to salute that motherfucker a whole bunch of times right at home in New York City due to uh, every man's hand being against his brother, because Esau is your brother. The Muslims is your brother. Okay, y'all all business partners. Them the motherfuckers 
that sold us to you and who you sold us to. So y'all all brothers, okay? And that's why the Most High that stirred up, okay, that cup of uh, madness, all right, and confusion and fury, and all you people are drunk off of it, all right? And you're going to stumble, spew, throw up, fall, and never rise again, all right? For the mouth of Yahweh has spoken it, okay? All right. Verse 10 again. And the devil that deceived them was cast into the lake of fire and brimstone, where the beast and the false prophet are. And they shall be, and they, and shall be tormented day and night forever and ever, okay? So that's your fate for worshiping the beast who is Ashkenaz. Ashkenaz is the damn beast, okay? And the Roman Catholic Church doctrine is the false prophet doctrine, all right? That's right. All that's perversion. Okay? Just like Islam. It's perversion of the truth. Alright? The Most High ain't gonna suffer you people no longer with your damn abominations. Alright? Your sins have reached up to heaven, Babylon. Okay? That's right. The Most High gonna get you. He gonna get you. Okay? Yeah. He gonna get you real good, alright? Wicked ass nations. Yeah, we mocking your ass. All right. That's right. Fuck you. Okay. Mr. FBI profiler. Okay, you pussy motherfuckers. There's no way that you could be surveilling us and watching us to try to come up with any legitimate, uh, any uh, legitimate charges, accusations. Complaints or any legitimate litigation Okay Truly What kind of motherfucking terrorist attack Are we as Hebrew Israelites Or so called black identity Extremists as you like to call us What plots are we What, 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 what the fuck are we doing Okay In a carnal fashion To harm anybody in this country Now Am I saying that A, uh, uh, a couple times a a brother's been stirred up to whack a few of you people? No. And I don't regret that they did it. Okay? That's justice. Alright? But what I'm saying is that we don't stand out here and uh, promote or preach, pick up a gun, and go and kill off the heathens. That's not what we do. No, what we do is what I just did. We read the scriptures, being sealed, being the elect, being with him everywhere he goes, as he also goes forth in righteousness and make war so when he go forth and make war we with him to make war with him against you fucking heathen okay and so I'm out here on the battlefield with the Lord Jesus okay and he's smiting you with the sword of his mouth alright and we're gonna smite your ass some more we're gonna, we're gonna let the earth swallow up a whole bunch of more okay we're gonna let the fowls of the air eat the flesh of a whole lot more Okay, we're gonna let the fire from heaven consume a whole lot more. Okay, we're gonna let Goma and his bands fall slain a whole lot more. Okay, we're gonna send a fire on Gog a whole lot more. We're gonna call for a sword on your ass throughout all the mountains of Israel a whole lot more. Okay, we're gonna be furious, all right, and indignant with you and hate you with perfect hatred a whole lot more okay why for the end is at an appointed time okay and guess what this gospel of the kingdom must be preached in all the inhabited earth and then shall the end come okay so i'm preaching that gospel that gospel that yahweh shai mashiach preached all right the gospel of the kingdom of heaven that deals with the elect which is all israel what's wrong you see a ghost or something what the fuck wrong with you you never seen a man exercise that so-called freedom of speech? You got your hand mighty close to your weapon. You ain't scared today, are you? You see what I got in my hand? What is it? Can you see? Okay, 
This motherfucker, that new goddamn body camera he got don't help him none, I guess, to tell the truth. You lying ass cocksucker. That's why your motherfucking ass gonna get more fire from heaven, okay? You over there, I like your sense of humor. Have a good day. All right, you, you have an awful goddamn day, okay? Thank you. Yeah, you're very welcome, motherfucker. That's right, Babylon is falling, okay? That's right, and these motherfuckers don't scare us none. This motherfucker got a body camera on, and he lied right there and said he couldn't see or didn't know what the fuck I had in my hand, okay? When I confronted him about his natural reaction to put his hand near his weapon, because he's a scary motherfucker. But, God, guess what? The most high gonna put fire on your ass, okay? Like I told Sergeant Ryan, I don't need the stick. The fire from my mouth get you, all right? The fire from my mouth got Santa Rosa, okay? Napa, all right? The fire from my mouth got New York City yesterday, okay? That's right. And we're going to keep getting you with the fire from my mouth, babble. That's right. That's right. It's a sword. It's a sword drawn, okay? It's a sword drawn and furbished, all right? And it shall be made fat, okay? Fat with the kidneys, with blood and the kidneys of rams, okay? The Most High got a great sacrifice, okay? That's right. He gonna get you. He gonna get you. He gonna slay you, all right? And the fowls of the heaven gonna be filled with your flesh, okay? That's right. Any of you that got flesh left, okay? Because a lot of you gonna be consumed and there ain't gonna be nothing left of you, not even so much as to bury your happy ass, okay? That's right. All praise to the Most High, Yah. By Shaman's holy beloved, Yahweh, Adonai, Mashiach, Judgment on the heathen nations. This day, the day of Yahweh. All praise.